Hello everybody, this is Orange Grove Nursery. I have my twins, Luke and Leia. I'm going to be putting them into Thanksgiving outfits that I created for them. And I thought while I was doing that, I would answer Wendy's questions that she had posted. And first I'm going to uh, get Leia into her costume. Thanksgiving gets lost quite a lot. And um, I wanted to uh, make a point to put them in their Thanksgiving outfits. So, okay, Wendy's first question was, do you prefer silicone or reborn? And I, myself, prefer, prefer reborns because when I first got into reborning, I went to a little dolly day where there was a lady that had rooms full of reborns and she also had some silicones and she was so proud of them and showed them off to us and when it was my turn to hold them I was appalled because it felt like holding a dead alien baby. It was cold and it was floppy, it didn't have, it, it was like somebody took its skeleton out and the arms were like all jiggly and it just creeped me out so I prefer reborns. And the next question was rooted or bald, and I would also add on to there or painted hair. And I prefer rooted, as long as it's done well. Um, my poor Leia, she's still waiting for her hair. I, I um, put my keepers on the back burner and uh, work on other people's babies, so my poor Leia, she's still waiting for her hair. But. If it's done well, I prefer rooted because it just adds to the realism. And the next question was magnetic or um, modified pacifiers, and I prefer magnetic. That way you're not worrying about goopy putty or anything like that. I have um, always done magnetic, but I always put a uh, piece of fabric on there so it doesn't uh, ruin the paint. And I just love having pacifier clips. Once in a while I like to keep a whole pacifier just because <clears throat> when my babies are just laying there, especially for Luke, he's a sleeper, um, sometimes it's nice just to have a pacifier that is whole. And the next question was, boy or girl? <laughs> and as you can see by my twins here, I don't have a preference, boy or girl, because I love both. I mean, I have two boys of my own and a girl of my own, and I love them all. I mean, some people say they prefer girls because they have better clothes, prettier clothes, cuter clothes, but there are some really cute boy things. So I wouldn't really be able to choose between the two because I love both. Almost done with Leia here. And then open or closed eyes and again <laughs> with my twins you can see I like both. It just really depends on my mood I guess. I don't know. I like both. It's really sweet seeing the sleepers because they're just so gentle looking when they're sleeping, but then it's fun to have awake ones because you can just, I don't know, it feels like you could talk to them. I know they're just dolls, but crazy like that. Okay, so Leia's got her little pilgrim outfit. It will be Luke's turn. Put her over here. <coughs> question was baby or toddler and I like toddlers but I prefer babies because they're just easier to cuddle with I think I don't I don't know I'm toddlers are adorable too but I like the little ones and Pajamas are dressed up. I like both. I mean, it's fun to have them all cuddly in their little sleepy, sleepy clothes, but then it's fun to dress them up too, so I don't think I could choose a preference. 
and bassinet or crib. I think I'm going to turn this shirt around. I made these outfits a couple years ago, and I can't remember if I intended them to be... <coughs> No, I did have it right. I can never remember what my original intentions are, so... <clears throat> I did make these outfits. <clears throat> Losing my voice. Bassinet or crib? <clears throat> now that I am... Um, working toward actually having a room where I can put my babies in as an actual nursery. I'm going to be able to have a crib and I kept the ones that my kids slept in. <clears throat> but bassinets are cool too, are, especially if you have a smaller space. But in here, which is my bedroom, I keep a cradle that my dad made for my kids, and now that they're older and don't need a baby cradle, I keep Luke and Leia in it. So I really like having the cradle because <coughs> it's kind of a timeless... Boy, your little butt is not going into here, Luke. There we go. It's twisted. Um, and going along with that uh, timeless thing, I, I prefer vintage pram. <laughs> I would love to have a vintage pram, but I don't. But um, vintage would, I mean, I just, I love the timelessness of the vintage stuff. I have some modern stuff too from what I use for my kids, but I, I prefer the vintage stuff. And uh, you'll have to ignore his hat hair because I am rerouting him because he had really pale blonde hair and I wanted it to be a little darker. But obviously I haven't finished so he has that old man look. So I just cover him up with a hat. <clears throat> so now Luke and Leia both have their pilgrim outfits and they're ready for Thanksgiving. Well, oh, she's going to be stubborn. Leia has definitely got an attitude. She is an adorable little cutie pie. And the rest of the questions. Bounce or a swing? Again, I don't have a preference. When my kids were babies, my son, my oldest son, preferred the swing. And my daughter I kept in the bouncer a lot. Mostly because that way I could kind of carry her around and keep her out of her brother's reach. Um, skinny or wide bottles? I don't really care. I don't have a preference. I do have um, Luke and Leia's bottles. They're just little skinny short things. And you might think, why on earth has she got blue in there? But anyone familiar with Star Wars will know that Aunt Beru gave Luke blue milk. So I thought my little Luke should have blue milk. So I made his bottle to have blue milk. And cats or dogs? I am definitely a dog person. Definitely a dog person. I am... I just don't like cats. And that is, I believe, all the questions. And now that I've got my babies all dressed for Thanksgiving, I hope you all have a wonderful holiday. <laughs>